guys so by the title of the video I'm pretty sure you guys already know what's gonna happen and I've told you in the previous video that this is gonna happen um, if you guys are new to this channel make sure to subscribe because I will be modifying my car through this channel because I will be doing more modifications to the car later in the future but for now let's just get started I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to hear me ramble or talk or anything so let's just get started all right guys so I just made it to the location if you guys want to know where this place is in the Houston area um, it's it's called CP Motorsports the owner of this place is his name is Carlos uh, he's a real cool guy um, he's given me a lot of information on tuning and everything because I'm, I'm still new to, to tuning and everything um, but he'll work well with you he'll answer all your questions whatever you have so I'm waiting for him to get ready, uh, prep up a little bit, because he just got here and it, he just opened at nine o'clock. So um, from from there, um, we'll see what happens. Just signed my car's life away. We'll see what happens. So right now we're just gonna tune the car, see what the power is right now, and to see if he can make a difference, make more power out of it. Um, but right now he's gonna run. Uh, like I said, a dyno tune on what it's on right now, what the power is pushing right now. And then afterwards, he's gonna make some modifications and then obviously tune it afterwards. This is it, guys. We'll see what happens. So just some uh, some bad news. I'm not gonna be able to tune it for E85 today because he was able to find out the size. But uh, so next time, uh, I don't know when it will be. I'll be tuning it for E85, and he'll have the right size for it. Uh, but as far as that goes, uh, I'm just gonna get a, a regular tune. We should be pushing more power than the OV tuning. Uh, but so right now, uh, he's downloading the software and then afterwards he's gonna be dyno tuning it. And then, um, so yeah, everything is going out as planned besides the E85 injectors, which I wish uh, we were able to install. But um, but not, not everything goes as planned, so. Um, anyways, for anybody that's in the Houston area that, ha that owns a Scion TC, I would recommend this place, CP Motorsports. I'll link it down below in the description. Um, you should check it out. He's a cool guy. His name is Carlos. Uh, he's hel helped me out through everything. Uh, he's answered all my questions. Or if you have any questions, you can ask him. Um, but, but yeah, I'll get back to you on the tune. Damn. Look at this GTR. It's a right side drive too. I don't know if you can see that. Look at that. It's so clean. We got Subarus over there.
Okay, so as you can tell from the tune, it went good. Uh, the only downside about it is that I wasn't able to get my E5 injectors. Uh, but, got rid of my check engine light. That's good. Um, so if there's any Toyota owners or Scion TCs that want to tune their cars, um, I highly recommend him. He does an excellent job. Uh, he keeps you updated on everything that he's doing. So from the tune I have on the car, he added more horsepower to the tune. So he did. He not only added added. He kept the software from the OV tuning, and he added his software into it. So I gained another 11 horsepower from 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 the previous tune and his tune. From the dyno, uh, I don't know the differences with horsepower. Uh, I've been told that you know, depending on the dyno, uh, they could lose uh, 10, 15 horsepower. So uh, from the previous tune, I was pushing about 184, and with the tune he added, I pushed about 195. So um, it did help. Um, and it also got rid of the check engine light but again I'll link everything or I'll link his website down below I think it's it goes straight to his Facebook but um, not his Facebook but uh, the the place itself so uh, CP Motorsports is what it's called like I said again uh, if you have a Scion TC uh, Toyota um, I highly recommend you going to him for a tune. Right now, since mine, mine was already tuned, uh, he wasn't really able to look at the stock tune, so if anybody with a Scion TC with uh, second gen uh, that is trying to tune their car and that hasn't tuned it before, uh, he would have liked to see it. Um, I don't know why, I guess to see the type of software that's in the, the Scion TC, because there's other plans that he wants, that me and him talked about in the future for this car. So um, he's trying to get a stock tune and look at it and then compare it to uh, compare it to my car. Not only that, but you know you also get a tune out of it. Um, but other than that, um, I will keep you updated on the E85 injectors. Uh, I was kind of disappointed that we weren't a he wasn't able to find the size yet, but. Um, I guess it wasn't meant to it wasn't meant to be yet. So make sure to stay tuned for that. Make sure to subscribe, uh, like, comment. Let me know what you think. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Please subscribe. Uh, I'll see you guys next time. Oh, one thing I forgot to mention: if anybody in the Houston area is looking to sell a hood for my car or know the right size to it, or probably could. Give me, uh, I don't know, somewhere website or whatever that has decent prices for a hood. Uh, please let me know because I have a huge dent on my car. I don't want to go outside and show you, but please uh, leave a comment down below. I'm trying to look for a hood or somebody that could fix it. Um, it has a lot of a lot of rock chips on it, and uh, either I could get replaced or should I? repaint it or fix it or whatever uh, just let me know in the comments below and i would like some help from that okay all right